breakup will mean even more changes for KU. Both Nebraska and Colorado are leaving the conference to join the Pac-10 and Big Ten. Problem is, both the Huskers and the Buffaloes are mentioned in KU's fight song. Penn Chandler shows what the school plans to do about that. In Lawrence, this is literally music to people's ears. The Jayhawk fight song, first written in 1912, lyrics adapted in 1958, and unchanged since. You don't mess with tradition at KU. We have had some comments from the Jayhawk community that perhaps we should reconsider the lyrics to the song. Well, maybe you tweak the tradition a bit. Changes are coming for I'm a Jayhawk. And you can blame Colorado and Nebraska. Yeah, I definitely think it should since it brings references to them in the chant. Folks would really rather sing about teams other than the Buffaloes and the Cornhuskers. Colorado and Nebraska figure prominently in the lyrics of the fight song. And while that doesn't bother some... I believe it shouldn't change. It's still part of our heritage, still part of the original Big Eight. It does mean the lyrics will be changed for the first time since 1958. It'll be up to the creativity of the students. So, yes, we want it to be driven by the students. They carry on the tradition that uh, Jayhawks have handed down to them through the years. Ben Chandler, NBC Action News. Well, the students will vote on new lyrics as part of the October homecoming celebration.